Hello Rangers fans. We bring you the latest news from the Shiz. If you're a true Rangers fan, give us a like to show your support. A £10 million transfer to Nice was rumoured before this season kicked off, but there is no longer the same level of interest. Michael Beal has identified the midfield as an area that needs improvement and has signed Todd Cantwell and Nico Raskin. With the exception of Ryan Jack and John Lundstrom, who was signed in 2021, the midfield has remained unchanged since 2018, and the only financial outlay was the £50,000 spent on Glenn Kamara until January. As Kamara is the only saleable asset left in the midfield, with Jack, Scott Arfield, and Stephen Davis out of contract in the summer, he is at a crossroads in his career. Despite having a contract until 2025, he could leave the club approaching his 30th birthday. Kamara is a player Beal trusts and would like to use for the rest of the season, and if he performs well, he will most likely stay. Dean Jones, a transfer journalist, also believes that Kamara's value is still high and that the time has passed for Ross Wilson to cash in on him. If Kamara remains at Rangers, it is possible that another year will be added to his current contract. While he is skilled at retaining possession, keeping the ball under pressure, and breaking up opposition play, he has not looked like the same player in Beale's system playing alongside Lundstrom, Jack, and Davis. However, the addition of Kentwell and Raskin should give him a new lease of life and allow him to showcase his abilities. If he is unable to do so, watching him play horizontal passes to the fullbacks could be a tedious experience in the years to come. So, what did you think of the news? Do you agree with the changes happening in our midfield? Don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any updates and leave a comment below sharing your opinion. And of course, don't forget to give us a like to help us reach more Rangers fans. Together, let's support our club and continue to bring you the best news from iBrox.